This is how German filmmakers made a dragon come to life in 1924. At the time, it was common practice to use miniatures to make things like dinosaurs and fantasy creatures appear large. But director Fritz Lang had a different idea for his two-part series, Die Nibelungen. In part one, there's a scene where the hero Siegfried slays a dragon so he can bathe in his blood to become invincible. The dragon he fought was actually a massive 60-foot-long mechanical puppet. It took 24 technicians to make the dragon drink water, bleed, and breathe fire. The giant puppet was designed by Eric Kittelhut and was one of the first mechanical puppets in film history. History. And believe it or not, it was so convincing that back then, some audiences thought it was real. 